Okay guys, now this is a damn mess, but it seems to be unveiling slowly by slowly throughout the day. And I thought, why not get into this video? Hey guys, it's Murad Murali. Hope you guys are doing well today. Back and again with another video. There is so much going on today. So here I am just reporting and letting you guys know. Head over to my Instagram, merch, products, um, links and filming stuff, everything that I use, whatever in the bio below. Let's just get into this. Now, for those of you who don't know who Georgia Harrison is, and you know that maybe most of you, no shade, no tea to her, but she was on Love Island in 2017. Um, which was actually quite a while ago and most people mix her up with Georgia from 2018 because they both have the same name and you know people are quite confused but Georgia Harrison was on the you know season 2017 and she came in as a you know newbie um, to the show and she took Kem from Amber and of course it shocked a lot of people and she had to pick somebody and it was just for drama the producers most likely told her to anyways but she has come out um, with making shocking claims that Stephen Bear I have no idea who this guy is, apparently some reality TV star, um, claims that he filmed her whilst they were together in an intimate fashion. So guys, we all know re revenge PRN gets a minimum three years, right? Do you think the sentence is worse when someone secretly films it like an absolute nonce without someone's consent? So if an ex was to film me on a hidden camera in an environment where I felt safe and then send it to people, that's gotta be a heavy stretch pending, surely? So Bear has CCTV around his house. He purposely got me in a position where he knew it would be on CCTV quite a long time ago. And after acting like he forgot the cameras were there, firstly, I had to give him the benefit of the doubt and just hope he just would do the right thing. Partly because I was ashamed and just wanted it to go away. But to be honest, I have nothing to be ashamed about. I was on private property with someone I had been with multiple times and trusted was in love with. However, since being away, I've met two more people he has shown and, and even seen a screen recording, so I have no other choice but to go public about the situation, not just for me, but for anyone that has been around there not knowing they are being filmed. I feel hurt, I feel violated, I feel embarrassed, but I also feel like my friends and followers will support me through this and I can't stay silent on the matter any longer. Wow. He responds, he's in Dubai. Well, I've spoken to the girl, I've been stopped making up silly rumours, so everyone's got to calm down. People was saying someone's name for Claire, it's just dumb. So now listen. This whole clout, everybody wants to say you're using my name for clout. These times, nobody knows who you are. So how can somebody use your name for clout, use your name, you know, for fame and followers and conversations when nobody even knows who you are? So that in itself, just, it's just confusion. It doesn't make any sense. She's now spoken out again and you're right there i've just seen your story i hope you're enjoying that beer and having a really good time and a nice laugh because i tell you what you're not going to be able to drink beer for a long time because you are going to go to jail for what you've done i have protected you for so long i so nice to you you've been better off ringing me up apologizing and begging for forgiveness not only because you know i'm weak you know i'm weak and you know i didn't want to have to do this and i would have took that down not only have you shown three people Wow, this is a mess. Screenshots of where you posted it. I've got three screenshots of where you've used a video of me on a camera that I didn't know was there to make money on your cheap OnlyFans website. <sighs> now she's crying on her story. One minute you're crying in the story, the next minute you're using a filter to address important stuff. Like, I'm not victim blaming, because I feel like, yes, you know, the guy's in the wrong and is an absolute waste man of a fool. The fact that he's doing that without your permission and putting it up to my channel profit is disgusting. But again, if you're gonna, it just, it confuses me with the emotions being quite erratic. However, she is going through an emotional situation, so it does make sense. Um, I really appreciate everyone's support. The DMs I'm getting are blowing up. I've got so many th those, so as I said, please start emailing me with all screen recordings or screenshots. I'm not embarrassed to own the situation. <sighs> So he's saying that she hasn't seen it in title. I don't know, man. Listen, I don't know these two like that. I feel like Georgia, yes, so I've seen, I reviewed her on Love Island, but that's really it. I don't know who the Stephen Bear guy is. Apparently he's using this stuff and I feel like it's just shocking. She has every right to call him out. She has every right to slam him. You know, he obviously should have apologized, taken it down, but now he's facing embarrassment. Now you're in Dubai trying to live your best life, but madness is occurring and your holiday is ruined because you are a fool you know you're just a fool let me know your thoughts are guys when it comes to this subscribe to the channel click that button and i'll catch you guys soon for another video